Hi guys, welcome back to my channel again. Kaim in here, and uh, yeah, in today's video, I am I am mostly mining though. So yeah, but for today, I think well, I have a spare D-class mining amp. Uh, it was a bit slow day selling this amp so far it used to sell above 20 K sometimes 30 K well yesterday it was like 5 K it sold only for 5 K amazing it was really really low volume daily so and you know it went down you know up to 1.3 percentage which is pretty pretty bad you know I don't know why people undercut that much when you buy residue for 101 percent and crafting it well you have 2 percent of it maybe for a 5 pet that's why I took one off I still have one two left but it's in the you know arcadia it's not really in calypso so yeah i have one spare left i think i might use it and uh, yeah good luck to me sit there relax and enjoy uh, put it in well, 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 that's my first probe. Two. Oh, by the way, I if you if you think I am I am not really keeping my secret at all. This is the area I used to mind, you know, up Ospra, and sometime it dropped. There's another drop. Sometimes it drops Ignisium, you know, reasonable amount of Ignisium. So yeah, if you guys interested to you know explore my area, sure. But I suggest you know, hey, it is a profitable area, and then you keep mining, 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 taking out all the profit that's not also not good in mining what you need is you know not a not just one place you have to put in mind maybe the more places the better for you because you know if one place is not good you can just oh, move on to another place so that way even if this area no good then you know you can just manage it let's say and let's say if you have like you know, 1000 pet of ignisium and then you undercut people hey they also want to sell their aura you know one time never mind it's just one time for maybe you undercut 200 TT pet of magnesium one time it's okay to do it because you know it's just one time and possibility that their aura selling they, they still have their chance and they, they could sell their aura too but if you undercut again and again over like 500 1000 2000 maybe people you know get annoyed and maybe piss off and yeah they also wanted to make some money everybody want to make profit you know so when you undercut them they will undercut you back and then again and again and again so what I recommended you to do is 
you know you can mine my area and then you have your own area as well not only one two three as much as possible try explore you know everywhere if this if this place good for you then try mine again if not good then just move on you know I'm doing this this is my first and by the way this is my first time mining with the class M mostly I mine on M and yeah this is pretty dangerous move but you know one time in a month I do gamble it out and yeah plus last month yeah I think last month I've been making some profit so you know losing a bit won't, I think won't cost me that's why okay I try it out and it is pretty dirty return so far let's check it out Wait a minute. No, not that. 40 pet spam so far. I don't know. I didn't calculate that much. Oh, I already have 100 pet of. Mm, yeah. I already mine like you know 50 pet of an M. I have to include that in the end of the video. But meanwhile, I'll be fast forwarding a bit because it it could be pretty long. It could be pretty long for the video, so I will be fast forwarding a bit. There we go, we get another Ignatium clay Ample, which is a uh, normal Normal claim for DMs, uh, the class M I guess So
There we go. We get. I think I'm doing not that good though because I have missed a lot and I get. I think I just. I'm just getting only like four claims. And. Trinity Drop, I guess. It's not really. You know, maybe half of our my money back but we'll see at the end how much you know see I I only have like 52 pet more but I don't really get 52 pet though in total I have to have 100 no no 260 pet because I already mine 50 pro earlier and yeah another 40 probe is with D class so I must have 260 pet to break even well if break even I'm happy though another claim that's good that's good I am going to lose some pet, or maybe not, you know. who knows, you never know what will hit. Oh by the way, yeah, I used to extract with the TT but this one I just bought yesterday and uh, because you know sometimes I do my alternative sometimes I get a lot of Lysterium that it is pretty fast because I prefer faster than uh, slower Actually, TT version is more eco than this one though, but this one does almost, you know, double, not really double though, like 67 uh, percentage more extract and pretty fast when you are trying to extract something like, let me get out. When you are trying to extract something like small, small aura like you know, like stadium, small or big, I don't really know that. But you know, like stadium, you have to extract for like an hour if you if you hit like hundred pet. And yeah, alternative. There are also also some crude oil. Pretty annoying when you hit crude oil. Lysidium is okay though because you know you could sell Lysidium easily but crude oil is just a TT food. Cool. Last time I saw crude oil was 101% even with only 100 pets dead. Cool. I just sometimes I just TT though if I get a lot of crude oil. I think MA should do something with the, you know, crude oil. I don't know what is it, what is it used for. Now, maybe it used a bit more be because of recycle BP, recycle blueprint. Let's use. Uh, I even have one in my. Oh. I get another claim. 
Yeah, here it is. No? It doesn't use... Ah, it does use only a uh, ammo. I don't know, I thought it used uh, crude oil. But crude oil... I think it does... I'm not sure. Leave it. If I get cooked on that, just TT it. I don't care because it doesn't really have that much of uh, anyway, anyway. Well, I am overweighted now, as I see. You know, like right now, I am mining Ospra, right? Ospra does cost a lot of time, similar as a uh, Lysterium but a bit bigger. With this extractor it is really fast, just I'm happy with my uh, item though, until I can afford to buy a Justice Excavator. But that will be, you know, maybe it could be next year when I hit uh, something like you know, 100, 100kx, 10kx, maybe, who knows, but uh, I never have hit, I I have hit 1kx before two times, I think not two times, three times I hit before though, but, you know, more than that, I have never hit more than 1kx or so 1kx is... I confirm people could hit 1kx on hunting, mining, crafting but crafting is a hunting mm, hunting TT return is kind of like I don't know chaotic you know, sometimes you you spend like hundred pet, thousand of pet, you still not get single global or single good return. You always keep getting shitty item, and then you know keep losing in TP. But mining, I am getting you know decent TT return, so. But people seem to get bored by uh, mining because it doesn't really, you know, you're just running around and mining, drop a probe, walk around. But I do like it because, you know, it gives me profit much more than uh, hunting. Hunting, I have, I ever hunted before, you know, using, I don't know, I buy. Now using a matrix gun and then I went one time hunting petrols and another time I don't know what kind of monster hunt. I don't know, I'm not sure what kind of all cables I also hunted. I get keep I just keep getting shitty at them. Petros never drop me one ESI after I spend like 1000 pet on him so I just stop it because before it is you know too late to stop and then keep sucking my money no just stop it and I go back on mining and you know after I'm level up my mining I just keep making profit in mining only in mining though well sometime in uh, crafting as well because I do a little a little bit of the class M not not that one. Oh this one I just bought yesterday 360 pet from Granny Rowin I think she is here, yes. Granny Roban. I just bought from her. She, she gave me really good price, I guess. 
it because it is it's not a it's not really it's not QR1 it's QR31 I can and look I can craft at 88% you know uh, for the beginner I don't think it is pretty bad though but you know blueprint for M you can just you know magically try to get 100 QR 100 well if you want to spend some money maybe you could buy for like QR 100 and you, you craft at 95% reasonable but you will spend like 2 or 3 thousand pet for blueprint well I just had 300 pet, 360 pet and maybe I will try to make my way up to 100 Cuba and I also do have that one D class M yeah. I used to craft two, uh, 4 D class M I put 2 on uh, Arcadia 2 in uh, Calypso but now that I have level 5 M I'll just I just want to put one each in each planet but if it's really so good not only in Arcadia then maybe there will be a place maybe Talon or you know some other planet Rocktropia can also be but I'll, for now I don't really have that much of budget that's why I just put one each on each planet and I'm thinking maybe also in asteroid former I am going to put one each on the former as well just I just have to you know try it out kind of like you know risk a little bit maybe it's not really risk of yeah maybe I if it doesn't really sell then I would lose like one pet and my pet is stuck there on the auction so I rather stuck only one M of each than uh, 10 M because I don't really have a bankroll for that and I don't like and I don't really like putting a lot of you know 5 M 10 M It's nonsense. I rather go do something else, put something else instead. Let's see how much TT do we still have? Oh, now it's finished. Let's get back. I think. Oh, I think we are. I'm not that bad though. I think I'm getting decent return. I hope so. Let's see. We'll calculate that in uh, trade terminal. Trade terminal. Yes, yes, yes. Hey. I hope so. We will check. Okay, we are back. We are back. One nine six. There's still some problem. Two zero three. So that's mean I lose a little bit. Or not not a little bit. Sixty pet there. Sixty pet. gonna sell that and how much do I recover Six pets. this could be two pet eight pet maximum of ten pet recover from NU not really good run but you know 
I managed to finish that M anyway. So, you know, it's okay. Sometimes try to gamble it out. Okay, guys, I think I have to, you know, stop the video here. Uh, maybe next time I get a good luck. You well, I have pretty good luck month this in this month though so I can really complain that much it's okay to lose some time but not always of course for now I'll see you guys in the next video good luck playing Entropia hope to you guys everybody bye bye